PR for being a dingus, that's for sure. I just want to say, I just want to put this on the record. If Nero ever watches this, I believe in his Zelda. I don't. I hope Nero watches it and realizes that his Zelda is absolute trash. I'll beat it in a money match for three hundred dollars. I have to wait. I have to wait for him to watch this vlog though. So yeah. Hope, fingers crossed that he doesn't. All right. So we saw a lot of patient gameplay from both these players mm -hmm. in their previous sets, but it seems like. Uh, Mo one like just kind of has that de like determination to really camp him up. I, I hate I hate to say it, but yeah. that's really what it is. Man, if it's not broke, don't fix it. Like yeah. it's worked so many times in the sets before. Whenever he played against Nero, so why why try to go aggressive now? Yeah, I mean like when you're frustrating Nero of all people, that means you're doing something right. Shout out to Division. <laughs> yeah, shout out to Arctic Fury's own Division. Hey. Hashtag Stay Frosty. <laughs> Shout out to Aquatics too. Shout out to Aquatics, the homie. Ripping the Detroit Tigers. Let's go. Three is possible. Yeah, and that. shout out to Nero here with this uh, like, nice 50 plus percent lead. Yeah, and this time that we were just making jokes, Nero's been able to turn this into a profit right now. Actually doing a really good job of keeping this percent lead. Let's see if uh, Lowen's going to turn those jets up and play a little bit more aggro so he can get this percent back. Oh, shooting the, <laughs> the peanuts the wrong way. Trying to just. I said peanuts. Come on. I don't didn't say that. Don't give me I, didn't, I didn't look at you, dude. I was just watching the match. Oh, okay. Punishing the down air. Gets him off stage. Which is going slowly, but slowly. Wow, he just going clapped to... him. <laughs> yeah, that was actually a really good different right there. Oh, my goodness. The double slap. The quick one. You, you see? <laughs> Two quick ones, man. The double. Smack, smack. Hey. I don't remember any other quotes from that, dude. Oh, okay. I thought the fair was going to drag him too low. Right now, Owen really needs to hold on to the stock if he wants to secure this lead. That skull bash may have well taken it. That would is really scary right there coming from uh, Nero. Wow, he, just, he used that monkey flip there, just uh, not monkey flip, but the uh, forward air, just mm -hmm. to kind of like pressure Nero at the ledge. Great like, Nero. He's coming back. Good yep. call out right there coming from Nero. Yeah, yeah, sending him up. Is that call his regular get up and also jump from ledge? Yep. All right. Using these thunder drills, trying to get that chip damage. Avoiding the banana. Oh, and the low one actually rolling back with him, trying to see if he can get some down tilts in, but Nero's going to be able to get around it. Now Nero's going to get his little string. Yeah, 37%. And, and he's going to keep going. That was a really good, uh, really good dash check right there. Yeah, I mean, we call it the skull badge, but like that's a side B, so it's like... Skull badge is a side B, yeah. yeah. Um, no, I'm... Yeah, yeah, skull badge is a side B. And his dash attack is just, I don't even know. No, I'm pretty sure his dash attack is skull badge. Back to the match. Money match. Side B only. Side B dash check only. Oh, what the? Really? And <laughs> one actually laughing at that too. That was a little, a little dance right there between the two players. A down tilt and two jabs. jabs. Still got spot dodge and just two spot dodges. That double back air, that up air to double, the up throw to double back air, that's like that, the 2017 Diddy Kong special. Oh, trying to drag him down with the forward everybody. That was the it. perfectly timed monkey flip to get himself right back into the center of the stage. Not onto ledge. This is exactly where he didn't want to be. Okay. We're back on the show. Uh, and we're back on the grind 24 7, man. It never stops. Yeah, we're back. No one's got his banana. I mean, he's just throwing out his neutral bees right now. He has no reason to approach. He doesn't have the percent lead, dog. Oh, Great punish, though. We're going to make that uh, lead even stronger. And Nero's determined right now to defeat his demon. I was saying it's working out really well for him. He's actually had the lead at the beginning of the match. And also now in the, in the end of the match, it's looking really strong for Nero. He's looking like it's been in his favor for the majority of the match, and it's not super close. Right. It's exactly what he wants. But only 10% difference, 11% difference right now. Oh. Oh, and Nero is taking his time at the ledge here. And like he's quick, quick attack, yeah, quick attack right over him. It's just getting him to an invasive spot, and also he had the banana right there, so that was really good. It's taking away one of Low One's best assets to control the stage. Yeah, Low One kind of uh, recognizing the, the situation he's in, and now it's just getting worse. Mm. You see him going for these more aggressive options than you're used to. Used to. He just got rid of the banana. You saw that pull? Yeah. He just like let it go. Maybe that was kind of a bait. He was probably expecting Nero to go in and try punishing him. Where see those? 
it's, it's funny to see these matches like between Low One and Rapazza and Low One and Nero because these guys play in a way that's super simplistic, but in the same way it's oh, super super cerebral. And Speaking awesome. of simplistic, just the simple banana to up smash conversion. Nero dropped his guard for one second, and Low One was ready to capitalize. <laughs> Somebody ban Advo from this chat, dude. Where are the mods, bro? Who's mad? I don't I don't feel comfortable commentating anymore, dog. Edvo just de emulated. <laughs> I'm done, bro. You commentating by yourself, dog. Oh, oh and we got the okay, Zelda! Alright, here it is. Let's see, let's see, because I feel like whenever he pulled it out in a sudden two, it was coming from a very bad place. It was coming from like a tilted Nero mindset. He was like, I'm done. I hate this. I hate everything. I'm just gonna pull out Zelda. Yeah, but, but I, I, yeah. I don't know, man. It's looking good. He, he has the five percent lead right now. So. Yeah, I did manage to get that Din's fire. Uh, oh I'm my ready. god! Oh my god! Uh oh! Oh! oh the score hop right there. Are you kidding me? That was so nice. Okay, stop it! Stop it! We got the Phantom. Shout out to the Phantom. Oh my goodness! Oh wow! I feel like that upstairs like, was actually really sick. Yeah, I feel like Nero like goes Zelda to try to like force. Uh, Low one off the patient game, but like mm -hmm. he's just going for it even more just to kind of aggravate Nero. Just kind of, kind of putting him back on tilt. Oh, I really feel like Low one's just kind of waiting for Nero to approach. Yeah. Because Zelda's approach options, not the best. No, not at all. Alright. That's why you're strictly only seeing like side B's coming from a. Oh, oh wow. and the stage he, Is he getting. No, he's not going to make that back. Unfortunately for some me, yeah, only, five percent only, only. Only that Din's fire. Yeah, that was the only thing to actually. And that's the worst move in the game. <laughs> yeah, for sure. I mean, like no doubt, honestly, that move is trash. Maybe off stage it has some kind of usefulness, but like yeah, it, the way that Nero's been using. <laughs> oh, speaking of uh, useful, this uh, Nero's love, on the other hand, putting a lot of work for Nero. And these Nairs are well. Nero's loving them. Yeah, Nero's love. Let's go. Let's go. I actually really like that up air punch as well. Oh! The down tilt? Yeah, the down tilt sets up to so much for Zelda. And he called out the monkey flip right there. That's that evil monkey flip. Oh, don't do it! Don't do it! Nero only 25%! I believe in the Zelda, dude. That's I'm gonna say it! I believe in the Zelda! Oh, Yo! Bitch! What? I'm ah, saying! What? Oh are my you goodness! Me? The whole crowd no. no! I thought he got the strong one! Wow, that was insane. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta relook the footage in the VODs. Yeah, that, that was some Diddy privilege if I ever saw it. <laughs> and what what started off is like some kind of like weird very, match. Yeah, yeah. That, that was like definitely in Loma's favor has turned around into something that Nero has a chance with. And I think it's because it's been punishing low ones attempts to get back into center stage. Yeah, it's just that punish game is so much stronger on Zelda. Oh my gosh, and that was a great uh, edge. Oh my goodness, the down tilt forward. Death shot. Forward yeah. attack? Yeah, 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 but whatever. The running uh, A button attack. Ooh. Down tilt in there. He's got the lead. <laughs> Who would have thunk it? Who would have thunk it after what happened? Oh, and that was a great walk away from the one right there, just yeah, kind of yeah. baiting Nero in. Yeah, like even if, if he opted for the, the Nero's love, mm -hmm. uh, he would have been positioned to punish it. These bananas have been working perfectly for Nero and uh, Low One. Both of these guys have been using the banana to the best of its ability. Yeah, both these guys at kill percent as well. Going for this banana once again. Oh, just throwing it down and just oh, the down to up smash. smash. And that's yeah. going to be just enough to finish it off. There's barely, especially on a stage like Battle for that. It was definitely looking like uh, Nero could have lived for a little bit longer. Yeah, and you know, like, both game one and two were close, but they were close in different ways, you know? Yes. Like, Zelda and Pikachu, like, have such a different play style. Because Pikachu, he has that kind He's, of, that kind of, uh, moveset that correlates, that coordinates with, uh, Sheik. You know, yeah. they both have a lot of, a lot of moves that can string together really fast and really quickly, but it doesn't do that much percent. Whereas Zelda, at least hits a little harder. Yeah. I'm yeah. not gonna say that Zelda has great strengths that are very, very strong, but I when the moves hit, they hit pretty hard. Yeah, yeah. Nero's punish game with Zelda has been very. Oh, he's been on point. point. Yeah, no, he has to have that kind of punish game, or else Zelda's worth nothing to him right now. Exactly. Oh, okay. He's gonna make it back. Yeah! Oh! oh! And that's gonna be it. And he's at seventy percent. I was 
way back in Ascension 2, when he switched to Zelda, the first thing I thought of was that down air, possibly interrupting. Because uh, not only is it a great spiking move, but also it lasts a little bit longer, so that's yeah. just perfect to knock low one out of the barrels so he can die in the fashion that he just did. Nero's looking to hopefully take this first game, unless Ziddy Privilege is going to carry low one to, to a 3 up. Yeah. Oh, trying to space that back here once again. He, he did it once before. He can exactly. probably do it again. Oh, oh! Combo. And he was ready for the forward smash right there, but Low One's just going to barely, by the skin of his teeth, get that monkey flip in. Oh, and he gets the lightning kick, but it's not going to be enough to get him back on stage without getting punished. Yeah, great star kick right there coming from uh, Nero. Yeah, shout out to the star kick. And I really like that banana pull coming from Ooh, Low One. Wow, Once just kind of waited for uh, probably Low One to blink. And that was sick from Nero. He, not only did he use that Nero to hit Low One, he also picked up the banana at the same time. And that forward smash was also a great call on the spot dodge coming from Low One. Oh, wow. He's got another spaced out uh, forward smash. Yeah, the thing is, forward smash is actually surprisingly safe. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh -oh. You guys are having a dialogue with the with the crowd or and with, yeah, with each other. No one even knows what's going on. I mean, we got a Zelda here in Shaman's top eight. Beat Ryu. <laughs> Once again, all the short throw. That's gonna be it. Yeah, seventy-eight percent right now. The low one could be losing his stock very quickly to uh, one of Nero's setups. Oh, the forward smash! Not, not no. yet. Not yet. Didn't get all the hits, unfortunately. Uh oh, going Man, deep for it. Yeah, Nero actually really wants to take this as soon as possible. You know, did oh. come to bring this back very quickly. I love the run-up shield. Oh, down throw. Be very evasive. Up air. That's there gonna be it. Is. Nero takes a game with Zelda. The Nero Zelda is real! <laughs> he turns back, he, he has to switch. He has to switch. He says, now I have a chance. You, you don't think that... You don't think Low One would counter character counterpick Zelda, do you think? What? You don't think Low One could character counterpick, do you? I mean, what do you think he'd counterpick to? Luigi? Luigi? Well, I feel like if he went Luigi, it'd be really easy for Low, or for Nero just to hit him on shield and not get punished for it. Well, I feel Nero, like that'd be a lot easier for Zelda. I think Nero is like worried about something because he switched back to Pikachu. Well, because now he has a chance. Now he's on the board. Now he actually has a reason to win. That's true. He wants to, you know, I feel like Pikachu has much more of a chance of getting two games in a row than his Zelda. You know, I believe in the Zelda for a little bit, but I don't think he's going to get one of those cheesy down airs two times in a row after he already got one. Yeah, but now he's back to this uh, Pikachu plan. And maybe he can apply what he was what he was doing with Zelda for what he's doing now with Pikachu, you know, covering those uh, high monkey flips coming from roll one. Also, maybe using elongated hitboxes or... Um, Hitboxes that last a little bit longer than normal the normal hitboxes. Yeah, kind of like uh, that, that Nehru's love that yep. we saw him utilize. To hit uh, Diddy Kong out of barrel, so maybe we're gonna see those backers off stage, which we have saw before. Alright. Banana trip at the ledge. He's gonna. Oh wow, banana trip right in front of uh, L1. And again, the two frame. Again? The double! Two I like quick the, ones! I like the double. I like the double jump coming from Nero and they get the quick forward air. Never seen a 113 in my life. Never, I never will. And I never will. <laughs> oh, oh the my slip right there, that's gonna be an easy down smash for uh, low one right there. Yeah, and that's an easy forward air too. Getting even more percent. 104 on Nero. And low one's gonna opt to grab the banana instead of actually uh, keeping Nero at edge. Nero's gonna stay fine at grabbing, re-grabbing ledge. Oh, he went a little bit too hasty in for that uh, that up smash. Not gonna get punished too hard though. So I feel like he, it's he can afford doing that. Oh, we're gonna have a little bit of a stare down. You can definitely tell that low one's trying to slow this down, seeing as Nero's bringing it back little by little. Oh my goodness, the gap is definitely closing. Oh, I thought man, I thought low one had that uh, roll scouted. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can definitely see a little bit of fear coming from the wall. Patience and shield right now. It's really going to matter a lot. Oh, oh, oh. and just call out real quick. Yeah. He said, hold on to left for a second. I'm going to give you these feet. Yeah, he, he was like counting the seconds for him to get hit by that. Oh, nice. Oh, I like the pivot. He actually ran back and then came back in with the monkey foot. That was really slick coming from low one. Yeah, they run back and then they make like it makes you forget about the monkey foot for a second. <laughs> he did the same thing whenever he was playing against that Zelda. He just kind of walked away from the ledge, giving Nero a whole bunch of space to land and then just punished him for landing. Yeah. Oh, oh the barrel technician. 
gonna get punished, but not gonna get his stock taken. And that actually did quite a bit of damage to Nero. And you gotta notice that Nero's still getting percent on him, even though he's getting these straight hits that are looking very scary for low one. Low one's still getting a little bit of chip damage every now and then. Commanding center stage right now, just by shielding, basically. Yeah, Nero just struggling to find his way in. Going for the forward smash. Get up here. A little bit more chip damage. It looks like the, the road to, to take this next game is looking very long for Nero. Looking very grim as well. Yeah, and he's only got 200, <laughs> 200, uh, 2 minutes and 45 seconds to go down that road. Mm -hmm. And now, <laughs> that, that, that took me a while to say. Okay, it's hard. Math is hard for everybody. Yeah. Okay. We can catch. Oh, okay. Oh, going right on the stage. Oh, 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 wow. Oh, that yeah. sure was Diddy Privilege if I ever saw no, it. No, that was fair. No, that was okay. I mean, there was, no, there was nothing wrong with that. So I didn't, I didn't he get him out of the barrels, 